who has never even spent a night in jail. And at 83, investigators say, the big tuna is the chairman emeritus of the Chicago Crime Syndicate. His tenure at the top is unmatched in mob circles around the country. In his halcyon days, Accardo lived in this 25-room mansion in River Forest. Although Accardo sold the property in the late 1960s, many of the amenities still remain. They include a 20 by 40 foot indoor pool, lined and surrounded by blue and white marble, a bowling alley with twin lanes, and a bathroom with gold-plated fixtures. Authorities took one last shot at Accardo in 1984 when they hauled him before a Senate committee in Washington. But in a two-hour session, a straight-faced Accardo told the Solons that he knew nothing about any organized crime activity in Chicago. We have information which may be said to be general public information that you headed the Chicago Organized Crime Syndicate for many years. Isn't that true? No, sir. That is not true? No, sir. Have you ever been associated in any way with any illegal activity? Yes, sir. What, what, what were those uh, illegal activities? Huh? What were those activities? I gambled. Have you ever killed anyone? No, sir. Have you ever directed anybody to commit murder? No, sir. What was your association with Mr. Al, uh, with Al Capone? None association at all. Just friendly. Hello and how are you? Although senators didn't believe Accardo's testimony, no attempt was made to 